Hey guys, welcome back to this. Um, today we're going to be doing another like studio tour type thing. I did one last year, I believe. It was quite a while ago. This room has gone through quite the transformation. Figured I'd show you where I am. And this is four or five hundred subscribers. And thank you, thank you, thank you guys so much. For that i really appreciate it i don't know why you would subscribe to whatever you call this but you did you're probably regretting that choice right now let's just move on to the thing that you guys have been waiting for the studio tour okay so it starts with this hallway thing we got this collage from my family we put pictures of my grandpa all throughout it. Mm. Take a second to find my favorite. Yep. Uh, so this is the door. I know, interesting. And... Yeah, so this is the room. I know. Okay, so the first thing you see really when you walk, I guess, is this giant uh, purple sheet um, with some paintings on it. This one is one that I did. This is one that my grandma did. Uh, then I have some Polaroids all across it, and I have this yarn going across because I want to put fan art on it eventually when I get popular. But behind the sheet is a bunch of storage of old things, like old stuffed animals. Um, then right next to that I have this ladder. I'm not sure why, I just thought it'd be nice. And I have a Harley Quinn magnet on it, and a Renaissance magnet from the Maryland Renaissance. Uh, then I have a bunch of LPS and woodland creature things. And those calico critters, I think that's what they're called. That's what this set is from and this one. And then a bunch of different LPS sets in there. And then over here we have like this huge entertainment center thing. Um, up here is a birdhouse that me and my dad made. Some old teapots and stuff from my grandma's house. Uh, some little knick-knacky things. And then in here I think I used to store my LPS customs in here. Uh, but now I just keep some extra accessories, like a very small amount. We have teddy bear. And then this is a canvas, which I put a bunch of Garbage Pail Kid cards onto. I absolutely love Garbage Pail Kid cards. I think they're amazing. I have- these are all Garbage Pail Kid cards. Let's see which one's on top. Oh. Uh, this is Quickly. So it's like flash, but he's running away. And then on the back, it's got statistics about him. And then this one's up because this is their mascot. It's Adam Bomb, which I absolutely love that card. And over here we have a mini pinata. I think it's so cute. I don't know why. I think I bought it for a birthday party a couple of years ago, but I just kept it because it was so cute. And then underneath that, I have this basket of books and a munchie cheeto that I got when I was littler. Then I have one of my favorite books by my absolute favorite author of all time, Darren Shane. I love his books so much. He's like the only person I read books of. My favorite series of his is The Demon Tana. I definitely recommend checking him out. And under here, we have a bunch of My Little Ponies. And just some random stuff. This is really just my random, I need to put these somewhere base. And over here, 
We have a turtle that I loved. His name is Swimmy. And then this is like a shadow box with a heart mason jar filled with flowers and some Tsum Tsums. Back there we got a Big Hero 6 pin from when I saw Big Hero 6. And one of the little peas from Toy Story and a Labbit. I love Labbits, they're so cute. Then we got a stack of Polaroids over here and a jar of Mod Podge. Don't know why. Then I have all of my dad's old records. So I put them on this record player because that's what you do with records. I think this is Jimmy Buffett because he's great. And then I have this beer mug. I don't know why. I don't, I don't know. And a candle and this thing that I painted with my dad. And in this drawer, when you slide it across, here I've got a bunch of old doll stuff. And I think that's pretty much it in there. And this is a bunch of doll stuff. My old Girl Scout sash and a Barbie car. And then in that one is just a bunch of books. So on the other side is this white table. Here's where I store all my blankets. And this is my LPS. So here are all of my LPS. This is where I keep all of them. I have some of them out, so I guess it's not technically all of them. And in here I have some, and here are some accessories and more accessories. These are just ones that didn't fit in my accessory container. Here is a globe, and I starred places that I really want to go to. Places like, I think, London area, Rome, Greece, New Zealand, the Amazon, Florida, New York, I think that's Puerto Rico, and this is a cotton candy machine for if I ever have friends. We can make cotton candy, because I love cotton candy, and I, it, I have it in the flavor blue raspberry, which does not exist in real life. This is a chair. This is really just a storage corner and a lamp. And uh, these are a bunch of chef animals and a bunch of Barbies at the bottom. And that's a CD player. If you don't know what a CD player is, kids, it's where you take these discs and you play them. I know, interesting. And there's a broken mic. So moving this way, that's my sister's room. And this is a mirror. Hello. Um, this is my futon. So I have just a bunch of random pillows. One that the Tootsie Roll one is one that I made a cover for. Then I have a bunch of artwork on my walls. Let's see, up there I have one that says soap. A Diet Coke can because that is my life. A girl without eyes. Why? Because I'm lazy. This, I don't know what to call it. A rainbow. Alien. A rainbow that says death. Uh, that's like a little self-portrait from when I did it. I cut my hair since, so I look different. And a cupcake. So I did all of those myself. That's why they look bad. <laughs> and then I have, this is like my little drawing corner, I guess you could call it. So I have this folded up blanket on the ground, a beanbag chair that looks like an apple. You can see the end of my fairy lights. And then this is a cloud lamp that I made. When you turn it on, it has fairy lights on the inside, so it glows. And they're LEDs, so they won't catch on fire and burn down everything I own. Uh, this is another painting that I did of an alien, I guess. Then I have fairy lights going all the way across my room. And then that's a trash can. That is, it used to be like an old baby doll bed, but I painted it and you can write on it with chalk. And this would hold like an MP3 player or something like that. And I have a bunch of 
old pins from Girl Scouts. If you guys want a story on how I got kicked out of Girl Scouts, <laughs> just let me know, because I could go on a rant about that forever. <laughs> And then here's a bunch of markers and pens and some drawing stubs and in there's some chalk. That's trash can that you already saw. These are my pencils, my sketchbook, and some more pencils. If you want a sketchbook tour when I'm done with this, let me know down in the comments. And then here are some empty Diet Cokes and on top of this that I painted. And this is all of my markers and pencils and stuff inside of this used to be a notebook cover but I painted it and sewed up the sides so it could be a bag then I have all of the remotes that go to this TV that no one used so I took it then there's a tissue box with a quote from my favorite boy band um boys don't cry from Spongebob I got tissues for my issues I need to ply, to ply when I cry. It used to have tissues, I think it's empty now. Then this is my light up karaoke machine because I'm just that cool. I won this um, in a, we were doing a school fundraiser and I sold the most stuff. And if you sold a certain amount of money, well, things, if you got a certain amount of money, then you won either $65 or a light-up karaoke machine. I went with the karaoke machine because I'm smart. We have the fabulous drag Trump, Hillary, and Bernie. Then back there, I've got some stuff that are assigned to certain sets. And that's a classroom set back there and a tree house. Those are back there because I don't know where else to put them. And then over here is where I film. So I made this little wood contraption and I just put it together so I could place all of the backgrounds up here. Um, my backgrounds, I'm not sure if I showed you, but they're over there. And that used to be a cover for so like a bed set that my sister had. So I just put all of my larger accessories and backgrounds into it. But uh, this is where I keep all my accessories, like smaller accessories. I think in this one, there is food back there. And this one is bedroom, school, and dresses and outfits. And then I got a bunch of pets that I'm currently gonna use after I film this. Over here, I have some larger accessories that didn't fit. And these two old customs, like really old ones. This one Chloe made, and this one I made. And if you don't know Chloe, she is my um, friend that does this channel with me. She's like my little sister that I never had. And then over here we have this like, almost like a coat hanger thing. Uh, on it, I have my Stranger Things hat. It's a Stranger Danger. It came into the mail for free, <laughs> and we just kept it. I, I don't know, it wasn't addressed to us, but I wanted it, so. Then I painted this for no particular reason. And this is a poster of the Eiffel Tower to kind of go with the kind of rustic theme in this corner with my record player. And then down here, I've got a bunch of large LPS houses and sets. Uh, and that's basically the entire room. Alright guys, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe. And you can see our last video at the end screen. And be sure to follow us on our social media if you want to see even more of my lovely face. I mean, why wouldn't you? Many reasons. I can think of so many reasons. Uh, if you have any video recommendations for us, then please let us know down in the description. Description? Down in the comments below. Become a shorty and sweetie today. I'll Wait two seconds before you leave. Um, I am going to announce that we're doing an art contest thing. 
And I know you probably like, who is this nerd on my screen? Get off my screen. You, what is this? Burn it with fire. Um, you're right. But if you want to win this contest, you should probably listen up, nerd. Called you a nerd. Huh. What you gonna do about it? Nothing. Because you're on a computer. Well, I guess you could dislike, but that that's rude. You wouldn't do that, right? Right? Hopefully not. Okay, so to enter this art contest, all you have to do is subscribe. And in order to submit, you're going to have to follow me on Instagram. I know that makes it kind of difficult for people, but if you, like, 100% cannot have an Instagram because of parents or whatever reason, then you can email the picture to me, and I will leave my email down below for you. Um, so what you're going to draw is any character from any of my series or anything that you've seen and you're gonna send those to me I'm going to pick a winner and the winner is going to get a prize what is the prize that's a secret you'll find out but um be sure if you want to enter you should subscribe because one it's rude not to put a lot of effort clearly I guess that's all I have to say um, back to you, Past Riley. I'll never say that again. That was awful.